Hi, Evie here for DearMob, and in this video, we'll talk about how to fully bank up and restore iPhone with simple method, and it's also applicable to iPad and iPod. In this case, we're using an iPhone 6 and an iPhone 10, and we're going to fully bank up this old iPhone 6 and restore it to iPhone 10. Speaking of that, I know some of you guys got fed up with clumsy iTunes setup and limited storage of iCloud and security issues, or just get confused with iCloud Backup and iCloud Drive. So I'm going to show you a super easy and straightforward method using DearMob iPhone Manager, which is an easy iOS manager versatile in file management, data security, and device backup. And of course, I'll include a link in the description as always. Getting started, click open DearMob iPhone Manager and connect iPhone 6 with data cable. Okay, here I can see that my iPhone is connected with the device name and how many gigabytes is left. And here is the iOS version. Now click backup icon and then you have two options. You can simply hit backup now and wait until it's done. But I'm not gonna hit it now because I feel unsecured without encryption. You see, anyone can restore that file if they are using this computer. So I'd like to take this to encrypt my backup. So you are required to input a password. Okay, I'll do this one. You can choose any letter and number combinations. Just make sure you have both uppercase and lowercase letter in the input string. Then hit OK and backup now and you will be all set. Just drink a cup of coffee and wait until it's done. Please remember the backup password that you just said. It's very important. Since DearMob iPhone Manager will not remember the password, so if you forget it, you will have trouble restoring the backup files. Please stand by, and here you can see it is in progress. This can take some minutes before it fully put all of your files onto the computer. It depends on the size of files on your device. For instance, this iPhone 6 is 64 gigabytes by design, and there are 30 some gigabytes left, so it takes a while as the file is quite large. Okay, great, the backup is done, and you can find your back data here by clicking this bar at the top. See here, the first one is an iPad backup file, which I made yesterday, and below this iPhone 6 is my iPhone 6 backup data that we've made just now, and the lock icon here means it is an encrypted backup file. And now I want this iPhone 10 looks exactly like my old iPhone 6, so let's unplug the old iPhone and connect the iPhone 10. We see DearMob iPhone Manager quickly recognize the device, and here we can see it is installed with the latest iOS 12. Now let's click backup and go to this tab. You can see the device name here, iOS version, file size, and backup time. It's quite handy for you to spot your target file if you already have a bunch of other backup files. You will mess up. In this case, it's iPhone 6 backup file, so I choose this one and hit restore now. Oops, we have to turn off Find My iPhone firstly. Now we are all set. Click Restore Now and enter the backup password we have set for iPhone 6 and hit OK. You can see on iPhone screen a line reads Restore in Progress. Please know that we can restore backup files of a lower iOS version to a higher one, but not the other way around. The previous phone is iOS 11.4 and the current one runs on iOS 12, so it works. Actually, DearMob iPhone Manager supports from iOS 7 to the latest iOS 12, and it keeps updating to keep up with the trend. You might want to backup regularly so that you always secure the latest data of your phone in case of unexpected situations. The restore is done now and iPhone 10 starts rebooting automatically. When it's done and you unlock your screen, you will see that the layout are all the same and I have all the apps here. Simply speaking, it just transfers all the data from iPhone 6 to iPhone 10, including preferences, messages, calendars, contacts, photos, and everything just like you would expect. It's just so nice that everything got mirrored onto this one. As you can see, backup and restore iPhone with DRMob iPhone Manager is super easy and totally secured. You can find the download link in the description or go visit the official site, fightkeyplayer.com. It runs on Mac and Windows and it's light about 47GB comparing to iTunes 251GB. I hope you enjoyed this video and comment below if you have any questions. Don't forget to subscribe for more tutorials and share them with your friends. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time.